folks, what is up? What is up? Uh, apparently, Shani's live right now, so I guess we'll go over there and, and uh, see what she's crying about, you know? <laughs> <laughs> but how's everybody doing? Roxy Boo. And now I hear that I am actually unblocked, so thank you for whoever, uh, you know, if people were asking. I do, I do appreciate that. But how, how is everybody? I'm going to get into the stream. See, it's so weird. My Twitch will say commercial break in progress. I don't know what's up with that. One, one second. But yeah, so I heard the police were called. This is this is so nuts. Hey, hey, Crash, hey, Mama T, hey, Roxy, Knitting Gamer. What is up, y'all? Oh, I have unbid. I have been unbanned from the chat. Well, that's cool. <laughs> Just damn commercial breaks, though, folks. So what what is what's happening? What has been going on? <laughs> is there a reason why she's coming up with all these claims? I mean, in my in my Ooh, I don't know what that was. Why don't you educate yourself? Hold oh, you or not. I am <laughs> Hold on, let me let me uh let me get rid of that. <laughs> I don't know why that's doing that. I think I pressed the wrong button, but that is fine, folks. That is fine. I'll just go right back in. I'm telling you, Twitch has been weird. Twitch has been weird. It's all been weird. <laughs> I guess the thing it says is that she's sorry. I feel I'm really sorry for Rev. Well, you know what? Same here, Crash. Rev should not have to deal with this. <laughs> you know, I mean, Rev's not. Rev is guilty as well, of course. Uh, but you know, it's like the blind leading the blind. You know what I mean, folks? And that ain't cool. That ain't cool. You know, Shani needs to chill out. She needs to stop attacking Rev. She thinks that they were so dumb. I'm just waiting to get this thing now. Have it up. You know, she's just like, she has to chill out, you know, like, because her, her first thought when Rev does something wrong is, you know, <laughs> and it's like, yo, Shani, 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 put down, put down the vase, <laughs> you know, stop kicking his balls. All right, here she is. I'm just being silly. Thank you all for being here. Now I can actually talk to her. And part of my brain just like <laughs> when I'm hungry. You know what, folks? I'll ask her if she wants to come on and rebuke G Man's claims. And I'll see <laughs> so what she says. Sorry. I have to laugh at myself. I can't beat myself up. I have to laugh at myself. <clears throat> My mom's like 56 or something, just not hit menopause. Oh, okay. Okay. So I'm just saying, if you want, if she wants to ever come on and rebuke no, any of G Man's not claims, that she, I will allow her to do that. The, the I'm Twitch good with, with the First thing. Amendment, folks. I had food a little bit ago and then shared um, the sandwich with Jason. <sighs> oh, God. What is this? KFC phone thing? is pretty bomb. I don't like their mac and cheese. I don't like their mac and cheese. No. Chick fil A, that's got a good mac and cheese. <laughs> she is hungry and high. <laughs> yeah. Of course she is. Oh, you did, Mama Popeye's T. mac and cheese is good. <laughs> yeah, I've had that, too. That is good. Is this the fight stream? No. When, when was that, Patty? Let me know which, which one's... Uh, that. This one's live right now. 
But yeah, tell me the fight stream. I want to see. Did you see Wendy's garlic fries? No. Oh, I know, Judy. Wendy's got it's garlic gross. fries now. Mm. But hey, guys, I was just getting it all together. <laughs> I like Wendy's. And Shaw, like what's Wendy's up? Too. Shani always does this, though. She always attacks Rev. <laughs> Craven egg rolls. Egg rolls are cheap. Hey, Mirror Bear, what's up? And you know what? It's 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 really messed up if you guys think about. Shani is in the uncle's house, the uncle who can't stand her, and the fact that she keeps beating up his nephew, I'm sure, is pissing them off. And if anyone would call the popo, I could think it would be the uncle. Just saying, I put my money out there, y'all. But uh, that's alleged, y'all. Go shop as well. <laughs> I want to get some string cheese. Mm hmm. Hey, Crash, I'm driving semi naked. Why do I oh, want no. to get string cheese? That's I'm how you rolling, Crash. <laughs> fucking calcium. <laughs> Just be careful, Crash. It's cold salmon outside. And wild rice with asparagus and black beans. <laughs> I went vegetarian recently and everything is so expensive. I know. I've had morning star bacon, unless they change the recipe. If they change the recipe, then I haven't tried. We mm. should try morning star bacon again. Oh, man. I just like bacon. Ha ha. Yeah, because I'm dating a pig. Make Get some Jimmy Deans and make some freaking biscuits. Yeah. She just gravy. wants a sausage, folks. Oh my god. No, let me make the gravy, baby. I know how to make it perfectly. Ugh. I learned from the southern peoples. I know. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> Biscuits and gravy, it's fucking cheap as shit. And you can get a lot of food. How do you know? You're not a doctor either, so how can you tell me what's wrong with me? Just go to a damn doctor, you man. dumb shit. <laughs> Why doesn't she go to a doctor? I, I get it, she's afraid, but come on, folks. I don't say folks. what's wrong with me. I have doctors tell me that. Duh! Hey, Revolver. I thought that said I meth problems. <laughs> every night if I what's up? Closer. I love cooking. Oh. Yum. Yes, don't crash, crash. <laughs> Definitely. They use that. You're not a doctor, Shani. Neither are you. So how can you tell me what's going on with my body if you're... You just watch me on camera. Hey, you're talking to your professional. <laughs> None of your business. It's your personal medical business. <sighs> Fucking busybodies. So are you. Shani, Shani, hold on. <laughs> Shani, this is Shani. God. This is God. Shannon, this go to a doctor. Shannon. Go to a doctor. Shannon. Please go to a doctor. Go to the, a Lord doctor. Says, the Lord says this is so. <laughs> go to a doctor. <laughs> You're a 58 old woman don't disrespect me i don't disrespect me don't disrespect me you came here talking shit out of your fucking mouth you're 58 years old you should know better not to talk shit to someone when you know nothing about them well, don't start shit with me you're 58 you should know you know what? I'll give her this. To, to some of the new people that are talking about her, I agree. They shouldn't talk because they barely know you. But people that have known you, that's a little different story, Shani. I've seen you play this game time and time again. And that's why, folks, you know, that's why I bring, I show the old videos. Because it shows a timeline, something she doesn't understand. A timeline of events and actions and behaviors that she hasn't fixed and it's only gotten worse. So I agree with her that maybe some people shouldn't talk about her, 
But us OGs that have been doing it for a while, you know, we know you, Shani. We'll see about that on Judgment Day, won't we? Hey, Crystal War, exactly. Won't we? What's up? I agree with Shani. Anyone the age of 58 should know better than to act like a child. Exactly. Hey, you know? Say that to my face, it would be your last time. You're 58 years old and you're threatening me? <laughs> so as I said, this is live. If someone could let me know the uh, the police video, I will play it. I, I didn't know that it was still on here. I know she'll probably delete it soon. So yes, please let me know which video that is. I was going to play the other one where she's like, the police were called. Um, but I will definitely play that one. And I just want to say this. There was somebody who who gave me a message saying that they were in their 50s, has two or three children, and has cancer, and, and MS, and works a full-time job. And they said, thank you for bringing this, shining this person to light and showing me the Shani effect. I've actually been feeling better doing more. And that really touched me. I was like, wow, that is awesome. That is awesome that this... 50 something year old can get something you know a good benefit out of what i'm doing here and that is what i'm doing here you know like no hate to her all positivity i love you all <laughs> that's how we have to do it folks we gotta do the negative in a positive way we gotta show that we're trying to understand her <laughs> but thank you to you know who who uh gave me that message it really meant a lot it just showed me that i gotta keep uh doing this and keep giving people the shanty effect this I mean, look at it. You can even tell I'm a granddaughter of the block. Three. Look at See her how face, flat yeah. that is? That's because you're heavy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Ew. I know Ooh. how to defend myself. Threaten me again. Ooh. She gets, yeah. You know what she does? She gets all. Come she gets on, all man. Slappy. You want to play? You want to play? Come on. Let's play! <laughs> oh, you didn't think I could be even more worse than you, huh? Oh, you tough, you tough. No, you not. No, you not. I've seen things and been through things where you would shit your fucking pants. Lady, don't be threatening me. Right? Exactly. Come on, man. <laughs> Want to start that shit? Isn't it great? She talks crap to her own audience and, and, and then begs for money. And please remember you're 58 and I'm 39. Please remember that. She could probably beat you, man. <laughs> In Minecraft, of course. Of course. I know how to defend myself. Just saying. Yeah, she unblocked me, but I, I had to do a phone so thing. I never did lady, that. You have no idea. No idea. Okay. <laughs> I'm the type of bitch that been going through so much fucking shit. If someone tried to fucking do shit to me, I would stand right in their face and tell them to fucking do it. Oh, you're so tough. Do like it. You, like you did to your son? Do it. <laughs> Trust me, I would. I'm that fucking crazy. Anyway. <laughs> the heat is on the street. Get down. That's right. Get to the chopper. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you, Crash. I just saw that. <laughs> We're terrified of <laughs> that. God, she is so nuts, man. I love it. I love the nuts thing. I love you guys hanging out and enjoying the nuts with me. Please like, folks. <laughs> you ain't blocked. I just think you're full of shit. That's why. I work for, uh, 54, 12 hours, six days a week. I'm, I work on the side in my garage, <laughs> all while carrying around. You just... Pops won't even <laughs> fuck with me, okay? 
Awesome they don't want to fuck with me. <gasps> okay. Oh, 800 bucks. And I spent I mean, 100. gave me the best dick the other day. It was ah. so good. She said it. Crash Kuderkut donated $5 through Super Chat. I'm 54. I work 12 hours a day, six days a week. I work it. on the side in my garage. You don't want it. Uh, while carrying around Discord, huge Patty. genitals. I'm just the struggle is real. You. I'm a borderline. You oh, don't want stop. it. You don't want it. Right, Shaza? Fight mode. Shanny's You're ready. Not the type of people you can do that to. We are survivors. Survivors. Survivors of what? Your own. And your own demise. Little fucks. Don't fuck with me. Yeah, yeah, Crystal. It, and it's live. It is live right now. You have to have the top bunk. Fuck, Dequan. Is anybody in there? I just want her to know that if she wants to come on my channel ever and rebuke G-Man's claims, she can. Beware. That's right. You don't want to fuck with the borderline. If someone wants to write that, we black like, out. you go on Draven's channel. And you don't want to fuck with me when I black out. I mean, I'll, I'll have anyone come on. It doesn't mean that I support them, you know, of, of course, folks. But I can have her come on and try to lie and manipulate me as much as possible, which which she won't. I just think it'd be funny, but who knows? I mean, I I'll let her come on as long as she knows not to try to porn bomb or anything. Shannon, you don't want Shannon in survivor mode. You don't want it. Okay, Mama T. You don't uh, want we'll it. We'll be right Trust here. me, you don't fucking want it. It'd be stupid of you. It's unwise. I'm not mad. I'm extremely amused at her confidence. Are you? Why are you amused by it? Because you're so damn Maybe ridiculous. It's I know what I'm fucking talking about. Oh, give me a break. Can I go down in here? Yeah. I think this is that better, folks. <laughs> if they can get to the flight of stairs. What? What does that mean? <laughs> you don't get it. They don't get it. They want to they want to laugh and act like idiots about borderlines while continuing to try to trigger them. You never went to a doctor that said one you were a borderline. Days, you're going to meet the Ron one. <laughs> the Ron. Because you like to trigger people with mental illness. But you're going to trigger the wrong one. And then you'll never want to do it again. It's serious. Like, stop fucking with people. It's, it's going to turn around on you someday and bad shit is going to happen because of it. Wow, is that a threat? And it's all your fucking fault. Because you wanted threat? to have a laugh. It's fucking dumb. To trigger people with mental illness. It's yeah, so is threatening people. Whatever. Yeah, my Tiggy Bear was all talk, no action. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Like, I'm trying to educate people. Like, you don't want to trigger people with mental illness. It is dangerous for you. And for them. Because they can't help going in that mode. Please respect people's boundaries. That's all really that was so you like that, you fat fucking... Philly guy donated $2 no. through Super Chat. Right. Like the stream, folks. Thumbs like up, that? medium light skin you tone. Like <laughs> Thank you, Philly I guy. think it's dangerous for people with me, mental illnesses, to subject themselves to things they can't handle. Yeah, me too.
And what's up, bro? <laughs> no, you know what? I'm not putting myself in triggering situations right, when Debbie? people are purposely coming to my channel to trigger me. I don't have to leave my channel and leave what I do in love because you want to be a fucking asshole. Do you get what that? do you love? Caprende? You, you 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 lost your kids and you haven't said anything about it. You beat up Rev and you and you deny it. You love this? This just seems like hell to me, but I don't know. Maybe you like it. Good for you, Shani. You're making us all better by you being worse. <laughs> Karma, No folks. habla espanol? Mm. Well, I said, do you comprehend? She's so evil. Are you saying I was age shaming? I wasn't age shaming. I was just putting into the reality that I'm 20 years younger than her. And so, you threatened her life. And she over threatened a comment. me. So is it okay for people to threaten me? <laughs> that would be great. And I it's can't always defend easy. myself by reminding her that she's 20 years my senior. Okay. I'm just defending myself from someone who's crazy. Yeah, she got her deltas. Her delta eights. Bye, Daquan. Jerk. There you go. I gotta head out. Okay. I'm not dealing with your stupid ass. Peace out, Philly guy. Good to see you, bro. Me, Pondu, you can fucking Be careful go out on them, on them streets. There you go. That's how I take care of the fucking trolls in my chat. I know. She's not healthy, Roxy. I bet that 58-year-old could beat her butt. In Minecraft, of course. <laughs> Yes. So Have Draven a great evening. wants me on his channel. If you want to rebuke your claims, Without yeah. Without talking to me personally? How? I can't. I, I have to do a phone thing. Seems I'm... like someone wants to use me for fucking views. No, 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 Draven. You don't Shane, use me for views. I'm not using you for views. I'm asking if you want to rebuke the claims. If you want to say you're sorry, <laughs> yeah. you better fucking do it. In private. Like a good person would. Sorry You're for Catholic, what? You should know. Sorry for what exactly? What do what I gotta be? What do I gotta be sorry for? Look at that face. Uh, go go. Uh, go go go. Okay, commercial break in progress. So, oh oh oh. oh, oh. Them oh, there, here she in is. Private. Oh. To say you're sorry. I'll send you an email. Take some okay. Words away. Shani, later on after this, I'll send you. I'll send you an email actually right now. Okay. How about that? Do you understand that? I'll send you an email saying if you want to rebuke your claim, it, G Man's claims. If you don't, you don't. But I don't need you uh, to be on my show. I can just watch your damn videos. <laughs> if you really sorry, if you really sorry, I'm not. If you really fucking sorry, you would know that I don't like being used for views. Yeah, I don't like people who do this to kids and their boyfriends. You evil person. Okay. <laughs> I think that's all the Spanish she knows. She's Irish. What do you mean? I know more. <laughs> Why you being freaking sexist like that? Can JC be, Jason be the one to preach? Honey, there is no male and female in Christ. Did you not read that? Hmm. 
Jesus gave me a mouth like any other male. Why are you telling me I can't preach his word? Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to think about that. <laughs> Give me a reason. A biblical reason why I can't preach. Because you're not I can't religious. Speak. For Jesus, please give me a biblical reason. Because I remember Jesus saying, uh, preach the gospel to every living creature. Oh, refute. Oh, I thought it was rebuke. I didn't hear him say. Sorry. Long day, preach folks. Every little you know what I mean. Creature, unless you a female, shut your fucking mouth. I didn't hear that. Man, Where did Jesus mad. say, preach the gospel Unless you're a female, you shut your fucking mouth. Where does it fucking say that in the Bible? It doesn't <laughs> say you, that in the too. Bible, does it? No, it doesn't. So if I want to preach the gospel, I have every right and authority given to me by Jesus Christ to preach. Amen. Not to go there, but Jesus was a man and want a man to speak the word. Really? Really? Then why, why was the first person to say that Jesus Christ resurrected was a woman? He chose a woman to speak first, not a man. What you talking about? What you talking about? What you talking about? Man, she mad. Oh, you asking Google now? Because you didn't read the freaking Bible, did you? No, you just inserted sexism in that shit. You didn't even read the Bible. I'm going to lower her a little bit. Mary Magdalene was the first one to say that Jesus resurrected. All right. Uh, but I just want to tell you folks right now, I just sent her an email with a link. And I said, if you want to refute, thank you guys, uh, you know, I, that was my mistake. Refute G-Man's claims, you can come on. And I don't know about her. If someone was talking mad crap about me and lived with me, well, not lived with me, but knew my living situation, I think I'd want to go on and be like, no, he was wrong on this, this, and this. I'm just giving her the chance I give everybody. Ooh. Ooh. How about you read the Bible? And then come back and speak to me. Don't be Googling shit. <laughs> Get out of here. <clears throat> Once you read the Bible. And I know you read the Bible. Then you can talk to me about this crap. You ain't Googling that stuff. That should be coming from your heart. Because you read the Bible. Not she because you're Crystal. Googling stuff. Hey, so Grassberg. you could sound sexist. I'm done, man. I know she is. She mad. <coughs> Thank Sorry you all for being that, here, like lady. It's the only way I get my sin out. Oh uh, well, yes. There's uh, <laughs> the flesh is still fallen, but the spirit is holy. There's that, and uh, you know, <laughs> that's how she also gets her sinning out. Unrev. <laughs> hey, Misty, what's up? G Man cusses like a <laughs> sailor now. I taught him. He 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 he's pro he, it's probably all that like hanging with them. <laughs> he's cussing. Yes, like thank you very much. Now. I heard what she said. He just pretty much showed what kind of fucking fraud he was. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, them. <laughs> they. <laughs> those people. You know those people. Yo, Shanny, keep going. Those, those keep going. People. Keep you, you, Your Twitch will be gone, okay? Keep going like that, <laughs> stupid. <laughs> she don't learn, folks. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, Brett's over there. 
they can't help themselves. They really can't help themselves. It's compulsive. Oh, hey, what's up, G-Man? It's compulsive <laughs> for them. I don't, I don't know. When did it's you really cuss? sad at the end of the day. You hearing this, though, man? <laughs> Ridiculous. Well, she just said that, like, I need to apologize if, if, I, if I want to talk to her. <laughs> Let's get you to bed now, Granny. Yes, I'm going to bed now. I need to get my beauty rest. Yes, indeed I do. <laughs> get a new bed. <laughs> <laughs> no, I... I no. didn't. You're right about that. I haven't Not heard right you curse. Now, bro. You, 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 you catch yourself. I would have to end the stream and go on the one in my computer. I could do that. Are you willing to wait? But then again, I don't want to lose my 97 viewers. It's always about that. You know? Hey, Purple Moon, you made it. Greetings from across the pond. <laughs> I could do ail you, just bob, and you would fall on your face. You could oh. do ail me. Thank you for the cash app, uh, Philly guy. If you hear this on the replay, I appreciate it, bro. I just saw it. <laughs> uh, I know. Well, she wants me to apologize <laughs> for talking to you. I just asked her if she wants to just, you know, refute the claims that you said, you know, because I give everybody a chance. So I figure if she wants to, but no, she says I need to apologize to her. So whatever that, what, whatever the, why I didn't do anything to her. So I'm wondering, oh, is she offline? Oh, she offline. <laughs> but my thing is, I want to know what is this live? I really want to watch this live because now she's saying she's she's offline um but here i'm gonna start playing to stop the slander and then if someone can get me up uh hook me up with that live because i want to see that but you know what if it was it must have been this one right the foods one well, I'm gonna play the foods video and see if I if uh, this has to be it. Look at him. What a bum. <laughs> okay. This is the one. All right. Thanks, Patty. Make your popcorn now, folks. <laughs> Fights at the end? Okay. Well then, you know what? I will, I'll fast forward boring a, uh, Rev. Because he is boring. Thank you, Courtney. Big ups. Cookie Ma. And you know what? I will say that. That having a community and having support does make... Puts the sugar in, in this, uh, disgusting medicine <laughs> that I want to drink. You know? It's nice to have just the support to talk to you all and i love you all and you guys just just thank you you know it really helps out and i always want to say that everybody who's part of the crypt you know that i love you all and i wouldn't i couldn't do this without you oh, oh she's beating me folks ha <laughs> ha send help You know, I'll I'll I'll, I'll, mm -hmm. I'll lower the music. Guy's so pathetic. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't want to do these videos. Ho ho ho! So beat me, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, my balls! Well, listen to her slamming cabinets around. I don't know, man. I've seen. I've seen, you know, crackheads that had more respect for the place that they were staying than these two. 
it's 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 really funny. It's it's interesting. You know what I mean? It's like, why you guys not care that this uncle could kick you out at any moment? Like, no, you don't care about that. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Then why? What's up? Like, what is what does she do? Now now I'm curious. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you are. I did not want to come on here. Yeah, there you go. You said give me your phone. Ooh. I did not want to come on here, Shannon. You know what, Jason? Are you doing this stuff on purpose just to make me look bad that I'm forcing you to do stuff? No. Yo, I'll say this. Rev, Jason, his mental illness has a thing where he tells the truth. And, you know, because you could beat somebody, <laughs> you know what I mean? It, to a way where they, they'll be quiet, but eventually it comes out. That's, that's what happens to an abuse victim. I mean, every time that, you know, this happens to Rev, he remembers it. Each one of those is a reminder. So it just comes out. It regurgitates out of them. No. I'm telling the truth that I did not want to come on here. Then don't ask for my phone. It <laughs> make me look like I'm doing look, something. He wants to me. tell her off so bad. Ask for your phone. I didn't. Yeah, he knows that's bull crap. Look at him. He's miserable with her. Leave, Rev. Pack a bag and get out, or kick her out. People think I force you to do stuff against the, your will. You do. <laughs> what is he doing? Man, stop slamming doors, Shanny. <laughs> That's all I hear. No, keep fucked up. Always make me look bad. I didn't even do anything. Yeah, she's always the victim. <laughs> Can anyone see me? Yeah, you were right there. I rarely block people, cringe. Only unless they're being a dirty mofo. And even then, it's like, how dirty are you being? <laughs> but now we're a neutral group here. Oh my God. How much more does he need to stick up for you? How much more? You're living in, in the house that the uncle wants to sell. Oh, thanks, Purple Moons. Purple Moon has just donated 5 euros <laughs> and 99 cents through Super Chat. Love and hugs to everyone, Purple Heart Butterfly. I can't with these two anymore. They literally go <laughs> online just to beg. Yes, they do. And thank you so, <laughs> thank you so much. I love seeing the, the, the Jason Avocados uh, dancing around. <laughs> but thank you uh, so much. That's for Rev. That's Rev's avocado. Oh. <laughs> Oh, here it comes. You do shit for me. Well, I'm always working my ass off. <laughs> <laughs> what? Rev needs to go straight up. He needs to go. Yeah, Judy, he is broken. You're 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 hundred percent. You're hundred percent right. You could at least tell them I'm not forcing you to do this. Oh, you are. You can at least tell them that. Yo, I love that. She's like, you can at least tell him, tell them that I'm not doing anything. You look at Rev and it's all. <laughs> oh man, Rev's silence speaks volumes, folks. His silence speaks volumes. That's all I'm gonna say.
Like the stream, folks, if you haven't. It's not forcing me to do this. God, you're an abuse victim, Instead Rev. Making it seem that I'm doing something against your will. It's very clear to everybody that I don't want to be on. Oh yeah, is he? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but why does it have to be on my fucking back? Why do I have to look like I'm shit? When I didn't even do anything! I didn't <laughs> fucking do anything! Uh oh. It's happening, folks. I don't know what you're talking about, man. <laughs> Red you better go. the audience where they're saying that I'm forcing you to do stuff against no. your will? No. <laughs> I'm so sick of hearing that! <laughs> Red better run. It's coming for him. <laughs> it's like all the responsibility is on me, and it's like poor fucking Jason, and I'm the one who's goddamn dying. All that right? I do. I'm the one who can't fucking even barely fucking sleep or breathe half the fucking time. But no, it's all on my goddamn back. Every goddamn thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Breathe in. Oh, it's all I hears. You know? <laughs> Yo, I love it when they just, when it gets real crazy real fast. <laughs> I'm the Why only you one that goes. There and stare? I'm the only one that goes out there and does anything. What the hell Why are you, you talking just about? Why sit there and stare, Jason? The only reason that you're able to get anything is because of me. So I don't oh, know. What the oh, fuck you're oh, oh, oh. The only reason why you can get anything is because of me. So? That's the point. I don't understand. I'm sick of being the only one that makes fucking money in this house. <laughs> wow. I'm and here's sick hoping. of the only one who puts actual fucking work into shit. While I'm fucking sick as anything, I'm sick of that. Why don't you leave me then? Right? Is that what you want? Yeah, kind of. Oh, you see that? Oh, 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 oh shit. Oh my god. Awesome, Rev. Rev. Just 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 end it, man. Just seriously. You got to end it. You got to end it now, Rev. You I think he's getting it, folks. Folks, he's starting to finally get it. What did I do? What didn't you do? What did she do? That's what she did. A little bit of a... Uh... This went well. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> well, you're just staring and not saying anything to anyone, Jason. Why did you even go on? Because you made him. Why did you even go on if you're just going to stare and look fucking like insane and then everyone's blaming it on me <laughs> and I didn't even do anything. Yeah, I'm going off and don't ask me to go on again. I did yeah. it. Oh, don't ask. Don't ask. That, 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 that means that means that, you know, like we we're all saying that she, that he, that they did. Like we all know. We we know what happened. We know what's going on with them too, folks. We get it. I I feel sorry for him too. I feel sorry that they gotta have police all the time, all the time at their house because she wants to get slappy. It's not right, you know. <laughs> oh, these two, man. These two, they crack me up. Um, yes, yeah, so we have, uh, uh Jason Eargroff here, uh, his girlfriend was hanging out, oh my god, uh, she's out here, folks, folks, she's out here, she's out here, oh, stop, wait, wait uh, ma'am, ma'am, put the hatchet down, put the hatchet down, oh no, oh no, no, please, stop it, stop it, ma'am, oh no, folks, please, uh, call somebody, oh, oh, wait, we're, we're the police, we don't want to deal with her, call like a whale something, <laughs> whale doctor.
Hey, Nora, I know so it they is. they called the police and false reported us saying there was the domestic violence thing going on. I didn't touch my husband. I didn't force my husband to do anything. <laughs> she begs That's him. stuff you're making up because you need to keep your fucking stupid narrative that I'm some kind of controlling fucking witch. Hey, well, if the shoe fits. And I'm so sick <laughs> of that narrative because I don't control him. Shani, he said, I'm not going on stream anymore because you make him go on. And she, you're like, no, I don't. Why don't you do this? If he doesn't want to do it anymore, you broke that man. You know? And it's unfortunate, but you did. You broke that man. And we all see it. Yes, Rev has done stuff. But that guy, <laughs> whatever you did to him, Shani, you know, like, you did it. He's broken. He's more broken now than he was when he was wet-brained. Just, just saying. It's horrible. I'm so I'm so sick of looking like I'm I'm some kind of perpetrator of abuse when all I want to <laughs> do is just fucking survive in this goddamn world. Exactly, Courtney. She does he does. He Not does. be treated like shit for trying my fucking best in life. I, that's not Because it's fucking <laughs> lies. I love that man. <laughs> Peggy Gruff. <laughs> I don't want to hurt him. Yeah, maybe there's times like, yeah, I don't feel good. Oh, you know, you know, Peg, um, <sighs> that's kind of where a lot of us were. You know, because Rev has, has, you know, Rev has came out and kind of hinted at that. And he was like, yeah, the cops asked me questions and I just couldn't remember. And I just couldn't remember. And then Shani cut the camera, cut the mic because she knows better now. She knows we can, most of us can read lips. <laughs> and she, you know, she got a little uh, sloppy with them, you know. <laughs> and after that, we didn't hear anything. But that's why it's always great every once in a while when this comes um when this comes out but you know what i predict just like g-man saying here in the chat folks um i predict more of this happening because jason rev he knows that he doesn't have long to stay in this uh, house his uncle wants to sell it i mean you can ask g-man he'll tell you that they have nowhere else to go Shani refuses to work. Rev refuses to work. You know, it's only down from here. They really need to split up to, you know, even exist. Good. You want to make some money for us? Oh, and here it comes. Here comes the performance art. She never feels good. I know, right? Is this but today? You call the yes. Cops for something that wasn't even a big fight. And then you call me abusive for just saying how I feel? Of course <laughs> I'm sick of it. I'm He's sick broken. of it. And that that's that's the problem. Rev Rev is is broken. He is a broken man. And people have tried. They've tried to be like, yo, Rev, no matter what, whatever you've done, let's get you into a hotel. Let's try to see if we can get you some sort of something just for you. And it, she gets in his head, folks, you know. But maybe if Rev would have had more than just a real doll in life, maybe he could have walked away from her. Because Rev thinks he's sterile and disgusting, like he said. You know, he doesn't think that, uh, he doesn't think that he can ever get anyone again to replace Shani. But if it was me, I'd rather have nothing. <laughs> I'm, rather sick I'm sick of it. I'm sick of being labeled as something I fucking not. <laughs> I'm nothing like that. I'm mad being called this stuff that I'm not. I'm sick of being invalidated. I'm sick of being treated like shit. I have every right to feel that way. Especially when I'm feeling like fucking shit. Always. And and to the new people here, what's up? I uh, hope you like. Hope you subscribe. Um, 
I just want to let you guys know, this woman uh, lost uh, her two children. 15, because she'll get into you if you don't say that the that the, the, the child's a 15-year-old and a 13-year-old. Uh, and that one's autistic. And Rev uh, kicked him in the ribs, allegedly. And uh, Shani has clotheslined her kid before. Probably both of them. And done other physical attacks, threatened to beat them up on camera. Yeah, so she's just mother of the year here. But she, you know what? Her fo her feelings matter this time, folks. She needs the invalidations because she don't feel real validated right now. <laughs> he took the rap. Well, you know what? That's that's it. a lot of people think that. He wasn't the sole provider for years. I've been the sole provider for years now. How? You you made uh, some money, but you've been kicked off because you say stupid things online. So you get demonetized. And people were giving you donations, but not near $700,000 worth of donations. And all the stuff that Rev has, like, like the house you're staying in now, rent-free. Like the internet that, that you're using that you don't pay for. It, well, hey, that electricity. It's cold in Scranton right now. If you look, it's like about 20 degrees. Who's paying for that heating bill? Really, Shani? Like, I just, I don't, I don't get people like this, folks. I don't understand. Like, beggars can't be choosers. You know what I mean? Beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> don't be like this, you know? I hope to the new people, we call it the Shani effect. You see Shani acting like this, and then you feel in your heart that you need to go out. You might not feel so great, you know? You might have gotten the coof, but you, you're you like, I need to be better for my family, for me. And you do. And I hope you get that Shani effect, and I hope it makes your life better. So that's what this is all about. This is more than just laughing at these people. <laughs> this is trying to, I want to give something to all of you. And I hope you take it with you and be a better person by seeing how you could be on the worst day of your life in Minecraft. You don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> oh, fuck off, Teddy. You showed what kind of fucking fake you are. Take your teddy bear hugs and shove them up your ass. Oh! <laughs> Take your teddy bear out. Well, I guess someone didn't get a teddy bear for Christmas one time. You know, Crash, thank you so much. Wow, you, everyone, uh, you know, big, uh, uh, well, I guess one's in the chat for Crash for gifting 10 memberships. She must have gifted a bunch of memberships so far. I really need to do a, a members only chat next stream. You know what? I think I'll do that next, next stream members chat. But I think most of you are probably members anyway. And if you're not, I don't know, uh, just show up, watch it. Maybe even if you're watching, not uh, typing, you can still get uh, a members thing. I found that out recently. He you're does out. help. You're right here. But not monetarily. And <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Brett, uh, I just I saw you talking in there. What's up, bro? All right, well, I'm going to pause this again because uh, this is just going to play. Uh, does it say who actually got the members? Boo, you got one. Congrats. So for people who don't know, it's just like a temporary, like a one-month trial. You know, uh, membership here is $2.99 a month. You get to talk on our crazy Discord. You get to hang out with us fun people. <laughs> And this is kind of what we do. We just like to laugh and talk and chill out, you know, because life is crazy enough, folks. And if you're not laughing, then I did something horribly wrong and please don't like. But if you are laughing, if, even if I made you just chuck a little bit, please leave a like. I would appreciate it. It helps the algorithms. <laughs> um, but yeah. But yeah, uh, congrats everybody who just got who just got a membership. Yeah, this is this has been nuts here. I'll, I will, uh... I 
thing's been I don't know, for a while things have been like acting weird on the on the uh what do you call it? Uh on the melon streaming. I don't know if this is doing this for anyone else's because I really don't watch anybody else's streams but mine and and this one's right here and a couple others, but as far as reaction. It's hard when you're a, a rea I mean, I don't call myself a reaction channel, but when you do that type of stuff, you really don't want to watch anybody else's because you don't want to be accused of like copying people or whatever the hell. <laughs> uh, I'll just let it play. But yeah. November. Oh. Hold on, I'll get membership. This is great. I <laughs> chat good people. Oh, thank you, Judy. I appreciate it. How do you turn on gifts uh, after the rain? Uh, I'm. I think it's a, a setting. If someone can help uh, her with that, that would be great. It hey, was a long time watcher. Oh, really? Well, thank you, November. I appreciate it. <laughs> I love him. Get a tissue. But please. I'm really sick of looking bad because of. of of this okay so you love him but you get slappy when he doesn't do everything you say i mean come on shanny you he's taking care of you now you gotta understand that before when you were taking care of him through wet brain and everything yeah you you had him but now it's like you should be kissing that dude's ass but meanwhile he's wiping yours i don't get that you know, like the manipulation really needs to stop and you have to learn, like you have to deal with him. Otherwise, more of this crazy stuff with the police is going to happen. Just saying. I'm sick of looking like I'm some evil fucking witch. <laughs> well, the shoe fits. We're trying to get disability. It's not easy. <laughs> Rev didn't call the cops on me. The idiots online called the cops. The fucking stupid people. Every time we, we oh uh, and uh, crash. Thank you for the uh, thank you for the cash app. I just saw that. Um, I appreciate it, <laughs> but I just want to make sure I I uh, said something because I just noticed it. We, we get into thank an you, argument or some kind of bickering. There they are. Thank you. He just walked to the store and got me a Pepsi. Thank I you. agree, Crash. Yeah, she don't love him. Something. Thank you, honey. I mean, if, if G-Man is still in the chat, uh, he's uh, at, at Sowing and Reaping, you can ask him, did, did, was she trying to get you when she went after Rev? And she did. She was. She was trying to date him. But G-Man didn't want her. But again, I don't want to put words into his mouth, but you can ask him that if he's still in the chat. But his, his tag name is Sowing and Reaping. And he'll tell you just what I just said. So she was going to date Rev without even knowing anything really about him. You know, I mean, she would see him online, but you really can't tell someone like how they look and everything. Not until like it's face to face. But she was ready. She ran over there. She put her kids into the car, drove all the way from Colorado to uh, Pennsylvania. Because her parents kicked her out like Christmas Eve. I think I'm pretty sure on that. <laughs> um, and after that, she just, you know, she was at the door with her kids. What, what was Rev going to do? I just saw a video a little bit ago. It's on my channel where he said, take care of your kids. Don't worry about me. Like, I'm a drunk and this and that. And like, I was surprised. I didn't think Rev had it in him. So I don't know if it's because of Shani's influence these past couple of years made it worse for Rev. That's a possibility. That's what I think. I, th I think, you know, Rev, I'm not saying Rev was great before, but, you know, he definitely had his mental issues um, with that blog talk radio and spouting stuff about conspiracies and stuff. But I do think Shani made it worse for him. But that's my opinion, folks. Because he's the only one that does it. No, that's not true, though, maybe the quiet. Why are you turning against me? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Are we actually in the stage where 
Shani's new members are turning on her because they see her for who she is. Isn't that interesting, folks? For anybody who maybe liked her before, you don't have to say who. But I know people do, and it's fine. People get uh, manipulated every day. It's a thing that happens, and in instead of uh, instead of uh, putting someone down for that, I just try to say, yeah, because it happens to all of us. Everyone gets manipulated um, at some point. And it's always interesting to be like, wow, look at these new people turning on her. Yep. And, you know, now we can just bring them right over here where we all can get the Shani effect and not ever have to live like this. Wait, there are people online. The cops know it. Every time they come here. Every time they come here, they're like, they called again. I'm sure. D do you need to go? Do you need help? Do you need to go to the hospital? I'm like, no. I'm just upset with seeing you guys again. It's not that I hate you guys. I don't. I'm just so sick of looking like a bad guy. Shani, wait. Didn't you guys just recently moved in there? Right? You just... Before before Thanksgiving, you just you're temporarily living there. So the cops showed up there, even though you guys were living somewhere else, and said, "Yeah, this happens all the time." And, and correct me if I'm wrong, but this house, the uncle's house, is pretty far from the house that G-Man owns in Pennsylvania. So it's not like it would be the same police department. So again, caught her in another lie. Am I the nicest person sometimes? No! But I'm going through more than what I can fucking handle in life. <laughs> and everyone's always like, poor Rev and his mental health, poor Rev and his mental health. I have mental problems too! Like, why is it all on me? Alright, I can answer that right now. It's not that you don't have mental health. When you watch this later, Shani, it's not that you don't, that people are invalidating that you're mental. We see that. We know you're mental. You don't got you don't got to twist our arms <laughs> like you do with Revs. It's that Rev is almost crying out for help to the point where people are really, really seeing it. Him not talking and everything, and you getting mad at him for that because you're forcing him to stream like 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 he has got a like he's got something to his head. <laughs> that's not good. That's not healthy. And that's why people are saying that it has nothing to do with trying to split you up or anything. It has all to do with Rev's face and his big brown puppy dog swollen eyes of despair and regret and help me. Put a pillow over my head in Minecraft, you know? That's why I think that people are like, wow, Rev really needs to, you know, get some help. And maybe if he gets some help, then he can talk to a therapist and tell them, you really need to get me away from this woman. I don't know how to get away from her. She's like a linebacker. Every time I talk to her about splitting up, you know, and I really need help. <laughs> I am not a bad person. I'm a very good person. <laughs> yes, he did. When's the last time I did anything for Rev? That's About a fair two question. Ago. Yo, she, he literally, literally got you some Pepsi, regular Pepsi. I mean, you should, you should be drinking Diet, but that's beside the point. He got you something after you just screamed at him and forced him to make a, a video where he looks dumb and he knows he looks dumb. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> I do things for Rev all the time. What are you talking about?
Shannon, this Shannon, is God. This Stop, is God. Lying. Stop lying. <laughs> Stop lying. Stop lying. Stop lying. Stop lying. To the best of my ability. It's mostly mental helping him, you know, teaching him some DVD skills so he can deal with his heightened emotions sometimes. I like that. I like that she always has to act like like she's you know, got one up on him. Like, okay, Shani, you, you manipulate him more. Bravo, congratulations. You you manipulate Riff Raff. Like, really, you think you, you want to get an award for that? That doesn't mean that you're better than he is. You know, that means that the dude uh, maybe has a heart somewhere. Maybe he thinks that if he's nice to you, you'll stop being, you know, attacking him. But, you know, who knows? That's just my opinion. He's learning sometimes. He's learning... Yeah, he, he, he learns. He helps, so I help him that way. I give him love and cuddles. <laughs> With cuddles like that, right? Whenever he asks for something, I share. <laughs> I do everything I can for him. He's a part of me. I never gave him a shiner, you lying sack of shit. <laughs> yeah, I was yelling. I lost my temper. I'm hungry. <laughs> no, I don't have a Christmas turkey. She's always hungry. No, you're not. No, you don't have to take CBT first for DBT. Cognitive behavior therapy is very different from dialectic behavior therapy cognitive uh behavior therapy is based on more of trying to get a grip on your your actions and how you feel with the actions you take while dialectic behavior therapy is more of a way how to cope with intense emotions i get hangry too it's okay some of us understand shani thank you mark i said i was getting hangry that's why i didn't want to go on Do another poll. Have I done it? DBT? Yeah. I did two years of it. Went to even advanced DBT. Am I perfect all the time? No. I probably do need a Snickers. <laughs> yeah, you do. That's true, Manifest. There. How did I force him? I did it. So end that fucking narrative. There's a new poll for you guys. That's right, court mandated. What's up, Ashley? I'd rather have a Snickers than a soda. And you still lash out. What did I do exactly other than say I'm sick of making, I'm sick of being the only one making money? What did I say so bad exactly? No, they didn't send me a pizza. They were lying. They lied about it. But hey, Artisha, what's up? Another person sent something Been a bit. which was sweet of them. So thank you for that. I don't like Snickers. I can't eat Snickers with my teeth. I can't, I can't eat peanuts or nuts or anything really hard. Oh, well, oh, yeah, I know he's struggling mentally. I wonder so why she's I. with Rev. <laughs> struggling mentally as he goes and buys her soda. Don't you love it? <laughs> Try to, Aluna. Jason's here right now. Seriously, a two liter? Yeah, why are you laughing about that? It's the only thing he could get at walking distance. Why don't you go get it? You don't need him, remember? You do a bunch of stuff.
I'm telling you, it's like, you never want this shanty stare. You know what I mean? Every time I see her looking at me like that. <laughs> She's creepy, folks. You know? Can you imagine Rev when he's got to see that? When he first wakes up? I would love to get mental health services through telehealth. Fuck off. <laughs> Couples get into fights and get and have snippets of anger with each other. Get off it. Yeah, I think you had you have a perfect fucking relationship. <laughs> yeah, but you know what Shani does is next level. She'll get out the fetish whip and, and go to town. I don't know if you guys ever seen the video where she she went to jail. I have it on the on my channel. There's this big long whip, and you see Rev's arms, and she was whacking his arms. With this fetish whip and they weren't doing anything sexual it was just because she you know wanted to teach Tim him a from lesson las vegas has just donated four dollars and 99 cents through super chat oh thanks Tim. keep up the good work shani is nuts and you make it funny <laughs> i appreciate it bro um but thank, thank you so much yeah well you know what i try to have a, a nice positive spin on it you know i know a lot of people just watch these videos and put in jokes and stuff but like i think sometimes you just really gotta you know go all balls in <laughs> thank you brother i appreciate the kind words oh yeah it happens to me a lot brett von hilton a lot <laughs> brett you got shout out She's it's 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 funny. She doesn't understand that a lot of people that are that talk to her. Um, I mean, I wouldn't say my people, but they are my people. <laughs> so, I mean, and it's just funny that she just ah she don't get it. But this is what happens when you treat people like crap for years, and then turn around and you think that they're your like your friends. Like, I mean, people can feel how they feel, but I just I wouldn't just. I wouldn't talk to people the way she talks to people. She's very not apologetic about the things she says. But I'm still waiting to find out what apology she wants from me. Maybe next time she makes a video, guys, um, or and I'll try to send her an email. Like I want to know, like what what am I doing that I'm I'm showing you for you? I'm not making up anything. I'm not I'm not making fake DMs or anything. There's nothing I'm doing that's i should feel i need to apologize for you to you but uh you let me know shani if you when you watch this video put it put it in the in the uh comment section why do i need to apologize for you to you <laughs> i'll look into that ivy rose telehealth she's live on twitch again that's what that's how i got my therapy um in colorado because of covid is i had to do it over zoom all right you know you know what I will 15 minutes. All right, I'll go back to this. Thank you, though. I appreciate it. I mean, this, this is a long video, folks. Even if I can't get it uh, this round, next round, and next round, I want a members only chat because I never did one of those before. So it would be cool to see actually how that happens. Uh, she's trying to dance. She do oh, oh really, Crystal Horner? Okay. Well, come on. You know we all know what happened in that house. <laughs> you know, she just she she loves to, you know, push her authority on people. Can you imagine? You know, I mean, really, I, I I'm with you guys. You know, poor poor Rev. Even though. You know, the cops are there. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, can you guys get me out of this house? You know? <laughs> well, uh, uh, sir, did she do anything to you? Well, uh, she will. You know, I mean, what did you say, Jason? Oh, yeah. Here she is. <laughs> they just know I went there for a minute to get something. Yep. So they're going to try and say something like this. It's fucking so stupid. <laughs> 
It's so fucking retarded. I know. I'm just waiting. They don't answer me ever. It's interesting. I'm writing fanfic over live <laughs> events that are happening right now. It's so fucking weird. Honey, you can always bring the Mexican girl home. I'll, I'll, we could do her like Dee Dee did to Chantel. Right. If they, what? If. <laughs> Ew. Sorry, I'm laughing at my own joke. That is <laughs> if there was one. <laughs> Which there isn't. Right? Right. Right. <laughs> I'm with you. And Angelica. I'm with you, Heidi. What was Angelica's doll name? Angelica. From Rugrats. Oh. Her doll's name. Cynthia. Cynthia. She looks more like Cynthia. That that lady that Nader's with. <laughs> the Cynthia doll, yeah. Yeah, the Cynthia doll. Kind of. I'm thinking throw Mama from the train. That's a great movie. Mm. Bring her home and have her cook and clean. Yeah, exactly, man. <laughs> yeah, so you don't have to do it. She could be our sister wife. <laughs> man, yeah, these two. Existed, maybe. <laughs> the Hispanic chick's kind of like me, so. That's okay, bro. Yeah. The sister wife. There you go. If she existed, <laughs> this is a fantasy. <laughs> it's an absolute fantasy. It's ridiculous. They he try wishes. so hard. Made up on live events, though. It's so crazy. Right? It's so bizarre. I love the movie Summer Rental. Oh, is, is that what she did? That. I think we may have seen that. They just, Who's they want, they want me to like put in my phone number. And I'm like, no thanks. <laughs> I have changed that five times. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Jason knows if he cheats, he's going to the worst kind of hell. He would never ever. No. I wouldn't. I wouldn't either. I don't want to deal with God over that shit. No. Mm mm. Uh uh. Hey, <laughs> Brit's in there. John Candy. <laughs> We did see Summer Rental. It has John Candy in it. I don't remember. Yeah, right, Christy? The Fallen Angels. <laughs> it's the one where he goes on the summer vacation with his family. Oh, is that the name of that movie? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah. Cause yeah. Oh, yeah. I like that one. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Right. <laughs> yeah, that was great. Jack yeah. Yeah. No, I love horror. That's your life. <laughs> well, enjoy your poop, Ted. No, I haven't watched Yellowstone. I did watch the first episode of Tulsa King. Yeah, not all the way through it. We're not all the way through it? No. Oh, okay. We still got to finish the episode. But Yo, isn't it nice? It's, it's pretty good. good. They got a TV in there. I can't tell you. Internet. I can't not tell even you. Not paying but for it. Let's just say it's... it's it's freaking funny. Um, because she, yeah, yeah, she is. Her, let's just her say tisha. the character that Sylvester Stallone is playing was in jail for twenty five years, so he's completely unaware how culture has changed, and he's currently like trying to, and he does these funny things that we normally wouldn't do in culture anymore. Is Harrison Ford in Yellowstone? No, I. I it's Kevin Costner, right? Mm -hmm. I love Kevin Costner. And she loves everybody except for Rev. <laughs> Dances with Wolves, one of my favorite movies ever. I should watch Yellowstone just to see how it is. Just to see how Kevin Costner is. Dude, on the 22nd of December on Paramount Plus is the new Top Gun. Yeah, against the the December uncle. December 22nd. Because who I'm else is paying? For that shit.
Yellowstone <laughs> is really good. That's what I've been told. I want to see it. Because it's Kevin. I like Kevin Costner. Goliath is good too. Ooh, what's Goliath about? It, well, obviously, it's about Goliath. It, 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 or is it about Dave? I don't know. Maybe it's not about that. This part is good. I thought this is a drunk this is lawyer. Oh, okay. So it wasn't about Goliath. <laughs> right? Yeah. Oh, the Terrifier, that like clown movie. I haven't watched that actually. Yeah, I got to it just meet seems that. Seems like dude. a rip off of it. Oh no, it's not. It's actually a pretty, pretty damn good movie. The director's a cool dude. I'm having a heat flash. I'm having a fucking heat flash. Well, watch. Fuck me in the asshole. Ew. <laughs> I'm nasty. having a fucking heat flash, and there's nothing I can do. You could take it back. Uh, <laughs> She's so nasty. She's nasty, folks. Uh, what is this? I I know knitting gamer. <laughs> There's a Pete's. Yo, you can't tell me the same. This is you cost bipolar. too much. Cause she's all fine now. And like, where did that anger go? I've been trying to cuss less. <laughs> I have been too, but I've fallen off the wagon. <laughs> In cuss central, but then again, I'm PMSing, so yeah, it'll be stop. hard to control. Because I'm at my hormonally the weakest. Is that an excuse? No, it's a reason. Man, don't you love when she starts shit? talking like this? See? <laughs> great. I know, right, Perpetual? She says it's masculine and aggressive to cuss like a sailor. What's that? Aww. Well, I wasn't the I didn't want him to be attracted to me anyway. Who? Oh. <laughs> I wish he was actually talking about what happened with the cops. It turns off most men except Rev. I'm glad it turns men off. Hey, Ron, I hope so. Oh, Ron. Sorry. I never Revolver. asked men to be turned on by me. Now, did I? No. Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. <laughs> Gotta keep a woman in her place. I know. Fuck, fuck, figgity. Fuck, fuck, fig, fuck, 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 fuck. There. <laughs> there what? What was, was, what does that mean? There. <laughs> what, Crystal? Was, was that, were you asking me something? <laughs> you like the attention from men sometimes, though. Yeah, if they get me. Ew. If they no, get thanks. me. Actually, no, I don't like that attention. There's this one dude on my Instagram. I'm not going to say any names, but... He keeps saying all these, like, romantic... You know who he is. He keeps saying all these, like, romantic stuff to me, hit me, and I don't even answer him, and it's really fucking gross. You just tell him to stop. Why don't you, why don't you tell him to stop? Ooh! Rat girl. <laughs> so... Shani, what do you think about men say it's women's fault sin was born? Well, I would say it's the man's fault because the man didn't protect the woman from sinning. And he was told to defend her. Uh, yes, it is. 
Yes, this is Moon Pie. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> oh my god, celebrity juicer. <laughs> So bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's it's just irrational generalization of women so men could try to keep a woman in her place. <laughs> it's just something we, we, we do what we say on Discord. A woman should be is beside <laughs> the man, not behind the man. Because she has his ribs. It's a joint effort. I believe people use women as scapegoats, too. I wish she used that money, that 700 grand, to do something, anything. You know, she could have gotten her stomach stapled. I think it's sure. dumb, frankly. To say you're going to put a woman in, in her place. Okay. Where is my place exactly? I didn't know I had a particular place in which you dictate a, in it of where my place should be. Please tell me, Mel, what is my place? Sorry. Yeah, stress has really gotten to him. It was it was G-Man. The G -Man. shit he's done. It really took him. No, it was not G-Man, really it was... him bad. <laughs> so, like, G -Man. he even says it's G-Man that did this. Yeah, of course he will. It's he doesn't want to me. All I do is support him, and I want him to be online and, <laughs> and be that old rev again. Because I know it made him happy. Hey... I hate that Later, yeah, maybe yeah. quiet. That really does not make me happy anymore. I know. Just, um, hey, what's up, Phoenix? Too much bullshit. I know. It's as simple as that. It's too much bullshit. Like, if I came back, like, as a part of somebody else's show or something like that, that, that might be something I'd be willing to do. But, like, Looking at a chat room and all that, no. I'm just done with that shit. I don't want, I hate it. Poor Rev. I hate it, and it gives me horrible, horrible anxiety. I know it does. So hey. It gives me anxiety too, but you can see it on camera. I see her ruining this guy's life. She does not even care at all that she's just like, you know, mentally, you know, like making him. Look at this stupid motherfucker here. A woman should fall suit to the man. Always the man is the head of the household. Does he have to deserve it? Or does he have to deserve it? Yes. But still, a woman is always subservient. I was going to say, make him a mental midget. But uh, she started talking real loud. Take this for subservience. I don't know. Hope, maybe Rev will Dig. see the light, you know? We never know. <laughs> he seems like he wants to. You know, he keeps cracking away Take and saying stuff to her. How about that? A woman won't allow you to speak. <laughs> <laughs> How many of us women believe in subservience to a man? That treats you like crap. Thank you, Appy Taxi, for giving me a rating. That's what I'm wondering. Hey, Lava, what's up? Audi, how you doing, Audi? 
Yeah, she did. Uh, she did unblock me, but I had to do a phone authorization, and I'm like, does, did she get my phone number? So, yeah, I had to do that. I don't have to be subservient to a man. I have to do that, I guess, off camera. Same as a man shouldn't be subservient to me. You know what works? <laughs> as a couple? Being equals. Oh. Listening to each other's problems. <laughs> griefs. Listening and talking and communicating. Uh, that'll be that'll be the that uh, holds the relationship together. That'll be the next not chat. bitch get in the kitchen and cook for me while I invalidate you the whole time like an abusive piece of shit. The only reason why you're saying is women should, should be though. subservient is because you get the power oh. for making the woman subservient. Who has what the power the in this relationship? What does the woman get out of that? She's so evil. She's so evil, I'm man. Just wondering, what does a woman get out of subservience? Like, no hate, but exactly. you know, she is. I really love that answer question, or that question answered. Like, what does a woman get out of subservience? Hmm? The woman gets nothing. Yeah! Exactly! We get no freedom. We got a man's boot on our necks if we're subservient. But you know what, dear? You are talking to an older woman, a much older woman. You know, I'm 39 years old, and I did the subservient thing just to be treated like utter dog shit. And, like, I didn't fucking matter. Oh, so you just beat the crap out of Rev, and that's So fine. why would I ever be subservient ever again? I did my dues on subservience to a man to realize it was bullshit. And that's not how I didn't feel good being treated that way anyway. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh. Thank you, Raven. I appreciate it. Welcome to the crypt. We have fun. We laugh. We're silly like like tonight. <laughs> mm -mm. She yeah, looks I 60. You, I, I, I know. She's only 39 here. Your own Florida mop. Yeah, exactly. Woo, you get your own Florida mop and sweep and, and you clean his underwear for him with the little fucking shit stains in it. What? Oh, yeah. Subservience is so wonderful. Yeah, oh, what are you? She's on another date with another man. Why does she do all these things? Girl is getting around. <laughs> Yeah, and when Rev shits his pants, the celebrity yeah. juicer, when Rev shits his pants, he washes his own fucking pants. <laughs> okay, what? I don't wash his fucking pants. He washes his own fucking pants when he shits it. <laughs> yeah, I gotta do a thing. 
I and it's not because I'm a horrible woman why he, he, he ha cleans his own pants. It's just customary if you shit your fucking pants, you wash your own fucking pants. <laughs> <laughs> why is Rev shitting his pants? What is wrong with these people? <laughs> I ain't your mommy. I ain't gonna f wash your shit pants. You do it yourself. Did he just weird. shit them? No. No, he didn't shit his pants today. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> he didn't shit his pants. <laughs> I'm just incontinent in my ass. Yeah. Shit <laughs> <laughs> board. Need that word shit board for the drawers. Oh my god, yes. Mr. Poopy Pants. Yeah. Shit the pants. I always laugh when he does, though. Oh, I got a commercial. You know, I find that that works better just have it like that. Because then this happens. Who takes bigger dumps, you or Rev? Hey, Charlie, Me. what's up? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I bet. Ooh, Ew. But And you piss yourself and sit. <laughs> Yo, wait, wait. she she wears a diaper. I've seen Rev turn the camera around when they, they were in Colorado, turns. and she had a, a diaper on. I didn't know if you knew that. Because <laughs> I don't remember saying that. But yeah, hey, Charlie, what's up? How you doing? I've noticed it's harder to push the older you get. And the... Right? She, yo, she's always And the getting just... up in the middle of the night to pee, that's really fucking annoying. That happens to us at least twice a night. <laughs> it, go, it, it happens to you too, I see it. Yeah, I know. I can hear that in your head, like, ew! <laughs> Dog shit. It is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah she nasty. <laughs> and then a lot of times it pushes, it pushes the shit through. And you're like, fuck, I got a shit now. It's fucking three in the morning. I don't want to shit. All right, after the rain. Uh, thanks for hanging out. Shani, I will divorce you if you don't get rid of these damn ads. We miss the good stuff. Janice. Mm. No, you can you can bite the bullet and give me the money that I need in order to stop the ads. Subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> Subscribe, girl. I know you can. I know you can, because she can. <laughs> you should dance for us during the ads? No. I don't do dancing. Unless I, unless I want to. Oh, she needs to get up and start dancing. I don't think she can hear you over the ads. Ha 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 Everyone keeps talking about ads. I know, they want me to stop ads so I don't make money. And I'm like, suck it! I want to do another poll, folks. You want to be a troll and watch me? Pay me. <laughs> Sorry. It's the truth, though. Us peasants have ads. Yes. You peasants have ads. You know what? That's what everyone, I should call everyone. That should be my, like, people. Hello, my peasants. <laughs> no, right away, 93. Holy crap. I'll let that go for a little bit. You want to be called the peasants? peasants? Hello, my peasants. I'm a huge Madman fan. I'm a poor piece of shit, and I'm okay with that. I'm not a peasant. I'm a pheasant. Caw. <laughs> Thank you. When are you coming back to YouTube? Never. Well, she was kicked. Never. Not until I feel like I would be protected. 
right? Even Negs is back on YouTube. That's because he's desperate for attention. I got oh, an alien and you're not. ad. Nice. <laughs> What do you think of January 1st Twitch Super Chat launch? They are? Frickin' yeah! That's awesome! Twitch is gonna start doing Super Chats. That's cool. That would be awesome! Cool. I didn't know about that. <laughs> oh, that's y'all happy. I'll allow that, the fucking pegs, cause he needs to be pegged. Maybe he'd feel better if he was. She already pegged him. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking pegs. <laughs> oh. Man, but it's fun they can't watching kick her DC off. Media Girl on Twitter, man. She just rages. I mean, she can only get a weak ban here. They don't really permanently ban people on, t on Twitch. I look like a cute librarian. Well, thank you. Yeah, this is live. Thank you. Uh, I'm also That's why I can't really stop like, it. I was in bitch mode a little while ago. Yelled at Rev. Acted like an ass. The whack peen has her all messed up. <laughs> I heard Mrs. Fucking Wonderful channel got taken down. Man, she is rolling now. I'm just not ready for that. I'm not ready for that. I don't want to deal with it. All that fucking YouTube fucking drama. It already comes sifted into my chat here already. I don't even watch that stuff. Like, we watch gaming channels and... and That's not true. And, uh... Well, she went, she came channels. back and forth. She was gone and she came right back. Like a half hour later. Yeah. Tyler Tube is fun. Why isn't Rev getting super chats? Because he has not made the hours yet. No. Because you won't let him stream on his own. And actually talk about what he wants to talk about. I think she went to bed. I think she felt better. I watch all the foodie drama Nader was trying to get another threesome going. I think so too. I said that this morning. Yeah, that guy's a pig. <laughs> they probably did. Oh, uh, her mm -hmm. Chantel's people are nasty. Nope. Don't want to think about that. Don't want that image in my head. It really is. I think Dee Dee might be replacing. That's another thing I said. Yeah. All you need to do is set oh, yeah. a stream and let it. Yeah, Ro, she watches you too. That's true. She's told me before. She just doesn't want you know, people to know. That's what Foodie's thinking about. All oh, that Didi's about to be replaced. Yeah, the narcissist has a uh, has gotten sick of uh, Didi. She used up all her usefulness, so he's got to replace her. That's what I'm thinking. Who knows what the real truth is, though. But it's hard not to see the disdain in her her eyes for him. And she's not eating any of his food anymore. Oh yeah, she's gonna look she's gonna look like she's like she's sixty. She needs to go to a doctor. Like for real. And find out actually what's wrong with her. Stop self diagnosing. The Nader set it all up to make <laughs> Chantel jealous look quite possible. You wrapping this up, I gotta get into the jacuzzi. Dude. My 
favorite book? The Bible. Sorry about that. <laughs> I've read it more times than any other book, so I figure it's the Bible. Besides the Bible. And then she fills Catch the bottle the with water. I know what people say about that. I just enjoy the story. I think it's funny. Yeah, but she's a And pig. I can relate <laughs> as a teenager and being s super impulsive. Oh, nice choice. Less phonies out there. Yeah. Y'all remember Wuthering Heights? Yes, I do. Yeah. Did you hear that disdain there? You were forced to read it. Yeah. Yeah. Ho -ho. Fucking horrible. <laughs> Dog shit. <laughs> I don't mind classics. Oh no, she's not a Christian. She just pretends to be a Christian. Do I remember what it's about? Absolutely fucking not. Classic middle school summer reading. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Or what was that? Island of the Blue Dolphin? That was another one we had. Uh, Great Gatsby, man. Oh. Yeah. And she only has 83 people Great watching Gatsby. her. <laughs> I, mean, I, don't know, I think that's pretty You funny. didn't like the Great Gatsby either? Horrid. Dull. Dog shit. <laughs> he Who just cares? doesn't want to do this. <laughs> Poor Red. Yeah, where the red fern grows. That was one. Yeah. We were forced to read. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is somebody who's lost I everything, folks. I work with folks. a doctor named Holden Colfi. No. No. That's awesome. Yeah, I swear though, look That's at those eyes. In, catcher in the rye. Yeah, I mean, it's holding. I, mean. Lord I of feel the bad for I don't Rev. think I read that one. I wouldn't leave. If I was the yeah. uncle, I wouldn't leave Rev alone with her. I, I wasn't, I she would eat him. If she I don't had remember to. reading that one, Lord of the Flies. I didn't have to. Taking my socks off. Oh, nasty. <laughs> hey, in 15 minutes, we might have food stamps. Cool. Let me look. Wow. EBT login. <laughs> That's all she cares about. <laughs> I know oh, nowhere's open. Seven. We're still on a balance. And nowhere's open. <laughs> Because she, he knows that she Yay. would say go to the store. Go well, we're going to see it if it happens on 12. It's like New Year's. But with food. Boo Radley. What was the name of that one? How do you check? Hey, Rev can't, you know, he doesn't have it in him to stick up for himself. Like what, it's like what Crash was saying before. Party time. Now I see why. It's that that was pathetic. To kill a mockingbird. Rev obviously wants to I leave. I don't remember that one either. Yeah, I, I read that. I know I've read all these books, but I don't remember any of them. Oh, that's what she. Oh, she's doing I members. Read them when I was oh, really young. okay. It's a membership chat. But. It's funny. I do remember parts oh, you mean of you're not a member. the Three Musketeers, and I read I it around you were, the same Brett. time. By Alexander Dumas. I thought you were. I'm sorry. I should have done it when you were a I member. I recommend that read, by the way, the Three Musketeers. I hate that those things come randomly. I would just give no. it to you. Huh. I, I mean, you'll be able to, you know, see the video. <laughs> I just, I haven't been doing them, you know. And I'm, I'm actually supposed to. <laughs> oh. 
we watch where the red fern grows no, in elementary I don't, I don't, and i, I cried and cried i don't remember <clears throat> i know we watched it but i don't remember it i was zoning out at that time maybe the guy didn't care it's because they would just drink Look closely at Alexander Dumas. What do you mean? Jack London. Hmm? Ugh. Hmm. Okay. Grant, you are always part of the Cool Kids Club. I never actually seen him before, how he looked. Jack London, okay. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> and, you know, it's good to get used to something like that. Shani has no, Call you know, wild. she doesn't do anything. So she has no, like, this is what I do, blah, blah, blah. Oh, and, you can read the full book. Yeah, she, I think she's wild. just getting boring. <laughs> That's usually what happens. She'll freak out and then she'll just relax into like dull nothing. So. I might have to read this. You guys let me I know. I like classics. Hold on, let me. Close this poll. Old Lonin's Nomadic Leap. Chafing at Customs. Uh, you guys let me know. Uh,. Put a one in the chat if you want me to stay stay with this live, or put a two in the chat to go back to the video I was watching. I'm not, I don't have time to watch it all tonight, but uh, the next one I'll finish up with that. But uh, yeah, so one in the chat for, the, for her to keep going with her, and then two if you want me to switch to that because I don't know if she's gonna get any more, you know, or it's gonna be like lol shanty. So uh, you know, like I do this for you folks, you know, it's all for you. So, uh, you uh, you tell me where to, where to steer this ship. Cool. Thank you all for being yeah, here. Yeah, like, like newspapers don't even really exist anymore. Sort of, they do. Yeah, sorta, but not really. They'll be. All right, so I see I see some twos. All right, so yeah. I'm go back to the other one. All right, that's fine. Like it's not like you can go to the convenience store like you used to. Well, that's usually what happens with Shani. She's she's very boring. <laughs> you know, she's very boring when she's not freaking out at people. And there it is. But it was worth it. Because I didn't even see this one. I did want to see it. <laughs> Maybe you guys have been cooped up too much. We all need space. I know, right? <laughs> Maybe the quiet. No. Hey, sweetie, what's up? I've had way too many please forgive me's and, and then they end up being an asshole. I know they're calling the cops on wellness check on Rev. Yeah, to make sure you didn't do anything. <laughs> we know how you get, Shanny. <laughs> you know, you, you got chill. Can't be Shanny's way all the time. Living at that house, rent free, not having to take care of Are anybody. Okay? Are you okay? Let me let me talk to you real quick, guys. I'll be right oh. back. <laughs> That's what's going to happen. Folks. Folks, let me just chill it down while we wait. 
They slower the volume a little bit. People shouldn't be like this, you know? There's no reason. There, you know, we can just coexist and there's no reason to fight. You know? Don't fight. You know, don't be like this. If you got a husband, a wife, hug them. Say you love them. Wake them up. They're like, what are you doing? Just, I love you. You help me. You complete me. You know, without you, I would, I, I don't know where I'd be. And I really need you guys to know that. You know? Don't be like Shani. Don't be like the Rev. Shani, where you're beating your, your spouse who's taking care of you. And Rev, who doesn't know what else to do. How can I help? How can I have this woman stop? You can't, bro. You have to walk away from it. <laughs> you know what I mean? You got to walk away from it. And I feel like until until he Rev learns that, it's going gonna, gonna to be a uphill battle. A battle that I don't want. I guess I don't want to be in it, but I'm, I'm definitely going to watch. Oh, look, my name is him. Jenny Dreams could have sent you. There's lots of people. He asked for these people. Could he unlock a game of our camp? Okay. Whatever. So what? <laughs> See, someone with fucking common sense. Oh, here we go. If I can't move, then how can I slap him exactly? What? Exactly. <laughs> oh, quit it with your bullshit. I'm so sick of your fucking lies and bullshit and in innuendos and, 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 and <laughs> innuendos and just all your fucking bullshit, dudes. Oh yeah, and this you're is the from the same before. person doing the same fucking thing over again with the same with a different fucking name each fucking time. You do realize I know someone offered to get me groceries. I would take that offer. I bet you would. Then why don't you then? Why is it always gotta be oh no thanks, we want Delta Eight only. You know, that's all you guys want. Because... You act like you've never had a bickering with your other significant other ever. Or you never got a... Yeah, you do it all the time, though. And you say that Rev doesn't do anything. I mean, come on. A fight with them. Imagine all the times you ever got in a fight with your spouse. That was like the first fight we had in how long? Like three, four months? Yeah. And it didn't even last long. Maybe two minutes. It doesn't block by IP address, but it will tell you if it's the same IP address that will come. That's coming on. Like I, they said, go to your your Twitter. <laughs> I went to my Twitter. There is no one, no new message on the Twitter, at all. No, Brett. No relationship is perfect. Exactly. No, no relationship like, treat me is like perfect. Shit. I'm just sick of the scenario. It's not that I fucking hate someone or I'm ready to fucking hurt them. Yeah, but I make donations too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's fair to say you're dealing with money. Cause I okay, you're right there. <laughs> Why can't I get my fucking pop out to work? <laughs> Thank you, Twitter. For Twitch for finally working for me. Bezos. <laughs> oh my god, if people hear the way myself and hubby argue, they would think I was killing him. Yeah, I know. Couples fight. It happens. Exactly. A a and they act like I'm fucking hurting him. And it's just like, I'm just sick of the fucking scenario. I'm just wondering what exactly I said that was so fucking evil and malicious and manipulative. It, can you answer that? Did I say something that was like that horrible to you? No. Are you really? Yeah. I love you. Oh yeah, right. I love you too. Yeah, he does. She don't. That's right, Summer. Another poll, folks. <laughs> Nerdy, time spicy, your boyfriend and you don't yell at each other yet. How long have you been together? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna happen eventually. It's gonna happen eventually. 
I used to say that between me and Chris, me and Chris, we didn't yell at each other or fight each other. And then one day it happened. Over a year, I respect him, he respects me. Well, you know, some people have mental illness and sometimes their mental illness gets the best of them, especially when they're hungry. Oh, and they feel okay. low and they're in a lot of fucking pain. The cold is so awful for me. <laughs> Von Helton is your grandfather? Really? I don't think Von Helton's kids are old enough to give him a, a said grandchild, no. but all right, Captain Barbados. <laughs> I've known Von Helton for fucking way over a decade. Almost 20 years. Same with Brett Kane. Almost 20 years. My husband and I don't do that. We have mutual issues. You're a liar. Yeah, no, you're right, Patty. <laughs> I 100% I agree. You've never your husband, or you've never had a fight with your husband. You're a liar. You're just trying to show ass. <laughs> what? <laughs> when my parents fought, I thought the rapture was happening. <laughs> I knew Von Helton with Vlog TV was the shit. So do I. So did I. What are they doing? Why is it like this? Doing their Delta. Hopefully not worse, allegedly. Oh, the screen is up? I didn't know. Sorry. You, what? I'm looking at the chat. One minute. I'll fix it. Yeah, yeah. You must be, you know... <laughs> I have a Revy Poo right next to me. <laughs> Here, baby. Oh, there he is. Look at him. What a victim. <laughs> we like made Poor up Rev. like two minutes after that bigger in half. Oh, by yeah. The way. <laughs> Poor Rev. How can you get a hold of me? You can get a hold of me through Instagram or Twitter as Shanty Needs Love. Either way. I just want <laughs> I just want friends. I want people who really love and care for me. Yo, look you know, at I Rev's don't want fake face. people who are just gonna pretend they're my my friend and then just dump on me. <laughs> I want real people who care. <laughs> oh, Rev's scaring me. Do you guys ever smoke regular weed? N no, <laughs> we we can't legally do that. You're not supposed to. Oh no, you look taller than me here. I like this angle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't be six five. <laughs> Unfortunately. I'm sorry, I couldn't be five three. <laughs> okay uh, make it work oh man we you wipe her butt she, you guys don't wash you. you didn't fight with me i feel the same way about myself honey <laughs> i feel the exact same way about myself Her face. I haven't been sleeping well. He sleeps better than me. He sleeps better than me. <laughs> How tall am I? I'm five. I know, right? His face on her hair. I'm a tall girl. About to retire. Uh, okay. Thanks for hanging out. What questions regarding why? Why do you care what I do with my donations? How is that your business? First of all, I'll probably do like another half hour. So I don't get what you're trying to say. I really don't care what you guys are trying to manipulate. <clears throat> Kanye is trending. Trending with Alex Jones. Really. Yeah, because Alex Jones like, you're not a Nazi. You're not. <laughs> and the guy, he's like, 
<laughs> Hitler did a, did a lot of great things. <laughs> Holy crap! Shut up, Kanye! <laughs> oh, you probably agree with it, though, Shannon. <laughs> that interview you need some mental help yeah he does man i've been watching pretty much every single interview <laughs> i can find with kanye and it's, it's just <laughs> i want to help him was the fight performance art no <laughs> it was me losing my fucking shit Cause I'm tired of living like this. I'm tired of it. I want to be successful. I want something. Then do something. The cop said I'm not the only one who feels this way. He 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 talks to a lot of people every day over it. Over what? A shout out to uh, what police zone are they? Why would you say that? Okay, shout out to the police that were here. By the way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah see that's why everyone knows everything because Shane don't care something I didn't know about the cops now because of the 2.1 billion that Tom Wolf put into the mental health services in Pennsylvania all the cops are trained with mental health they're all <laughs> trained for mental health so they can deal with people with mental health instead of you know treating them a certain way so like they're criminals or they're bad people they're, they're learning how to treat people with mental health which is awesome you know, they even offered to take me to the hospital. But I'm like, no, all they're going to do is drug me up with pain meds and I, and then send me home and I'll just be sleeping the rest of the night. Move to Mass. I can get you a job in Massachusetts. I've never lived in Massachusetts before. Pain meds for mental health. No, pain meds because I'm in severe pain most of the time. <laughs> And the cops know this. Like, you call the cops, but yet the cops know who we are. They know we're online. <laughs> they yeah. they know that you false report. Oh, my God. They know this stuff. Oh, crap. Rev's just going through it. He'll be okay. <clears throat> Kratom. I've tried Kratom. It doesn't work on me. And I even got that, like, um... I even got the strongest... That, what is it? The Red Valley? I'm trying know. to see if that worked and put it put a little bit in my my drink. Oh, awful taste, by the way. Bitter as fuck. Um, but it never worked. Yeah, that's how I feel, Manifest. That pain meds cured nothing, just masked and caused me more mental anguish. That's how I feel. And that's how I feel. It doesn't help. It's just, like, a short thing. And then the pain comes back even worse than what it was because... <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. I don't like pain medication. I don't like oh, I, I don't like that it makes me throw up. God, I look so skinny now. <laughs> no, you don't. Why should you keep saying that? <laughs> oh, I mean, for real. Her dude, arms wouldn't be like that. God. Thank you. Oh, my baby. Oh no, Rev, run. This is how she gets you. It's I'm lies. <laughs> I yelled at you. <laughs> Just saying how you feel. <laughs> what was that? Was that the cat? <laughs> yes, I have more than my fair share of pain. Huh. Oh, stop. It's all over my pain. It's everywhere. It, there's times where it's like even in my fingertips. 
Like, it feels like, elect like, G-Man's even felt this with me. The electricity, like, feeling that comes out of my hands. It's like I'm, like, fucking Palpatine or something. <laughs> Too bad that G-Man like, was... weird. Here still. Yeah, you can kind of feel it. Like yeah, ask him. It's not a lot, because I'm... Because the Cymbalta's still in my system, but... If I'm without my Cymbalta, the whole electrical system in my body goes fucking nuts, and I feel like I'm sizzling from the inside. <laughs> Like, it feels like literal electrical pain that goes through my body. It's the weirdest thing. Yeah, right, bro. <laughs> I like that manifest. Yes, Jason, you are loved. I would love for you to start loving yourself because when you learn to like and then love yourself, your world will change for the better. You got this. They believe in you, baby. Okay, that's nice. Thank you. He's a bonkers. Yeah, can you imagine? She's like, oh, the cops, they, 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 they know us. They're not going to bother you, so you shouldn't even call. Uh, dispatch, we just got a report that some fat woman's about to attack uh, some skinny little riffraff guy. Uh, respond. Oh, yes, uh, we're not going to bother that because we know those people. And, yeah, they, 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 she, she doesn't do that. She's so nice. She bakes pies. And she just has YouTube trolls. Don't worry about it. <laughs> really, that's not how it works, man. <laughs> See, there we go with that stupid fucking comment. Not as bad as Shan. Oh, wait, you're talking about my pain. Sorry. I am so defensive. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. He is a good soul. I know that. Shani does that all the time, though. She's always in attack mode. I know that. Run, Rev. No. Don't go back. Ew. That's true, Brett Von Helton. We all need faith. <clears throat> yeah, you know pain, Summer. Pain is pain. I have chronic inflammation and fibro. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah sure. Inflammation. I get you there. I want to sponsor an egroff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that would be beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> what you guys have going on tonight, just snuggling and being cute, pretty much. Draven wants to apologize. I didn't say that. Draven, are you actually going to apologize? No. Or are you I never said I was gonna apologize. I asked I asked you to unblock me. I said, can you unblock me? Oh, I can't talk to you. Well somebody if anybody, if somebody wants to ask, and I didn't send a bunch of people, maybe one or two said, hey, can you unblock this guy? I never said I was going to ever apologize because I didn't do anything wrong. I wasn't there. I didn't call the police on you ever. I didn't call CPS on you ever. Um, I didn't attack any of your children. Not now or ever. And do that. No matter how many bags of Tostitos chips you throw at my head. No matter how much, what movie we're watching, I'm not going to, that's not the guy I am. And, um, and I didn't, uh, kick you out of that motel. So what do I have to apologize for? I'm just wondering. You're just there to start crap with me again. Cause I didn't do shit to you other than that one little fucking troll by saying it was you that was given all the answer or given Jimmy and all this shit, you know? Wow. Okay. So you, you, you agree or you admit this, uh, for further clarification, folks, anybody new here, she, uh, last year she made up this lie. I mean, no one believed it, but she still said it. <laughs> she had this video where she said that me and some couple other people were given G men money to go after her. And I even told her like, why would I do that? If you're friends with the guy that, that doesn't make any sense. And she never uh, rebuttaled me saying that. So that that's what that's all about. But at least she's admitting that. Well, you know what, Shani? Um, you lied about a lot of stuff. So that that's my problem with you. It was just a troll move, but like... Okay. I'll give him one chance. But if he starts crap with me, I'm it's, it's done. I so. you know not starting anything I'll give him one chance you you blocked me because you don't like me because i don't 
kiss your big butt. <laughs> I give it to you straight, like I give it to everybody. You know, that's it. And maybe, you know, guilt by association, which that's not right. Just because other people are around doesn't mean everyone's involved in one person's bullshit, you know? <laughs> uh, other than that, yeah, it was it was all you. Because you're, you know, you're the one here with the uh, living in the uncle's house. Okay, not me. I don't want to be, I don't want, right? I don't want crap spewed at me. But I am a forgiving person. No, you're not. Tell that to your kids. She's so full of it. I'm a forgiving person. Yeah, she's so forgiving, folks. That's her forgiving. I have like hundreds of names, so give me a minute. Oh, you have hundreds of names because you're so popular. Because you're Shani for Christ, and you're the biggest lol cow on the internet. Homeless of America out. <laughs> I hate that friggin' attitude. <laughs> Living in America. Oh yeah, honey, right. That's a big difference. Uh, big distance. Living in America. Um, there you are. Uh oh, you found me. Uh, Ashley, I mean sh shock Pikachu face. She don't lie, does she? Well, no. No, no, no. Shani's a good person. She, I, she would probably only lie, uh, only when, like when she's moving her lips. But other than that, no. Or, <laughs> What's up, Ashley? He's been blocked since six sixteen of twenty twenty one. For no reason. Fourteen. Well, Draven, it's been way over a year since I've blocked you here on this this damn channel. So. Wow, she really like. So wait, hold on, 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 hold on. <laughs> I need, I, I need, I need to hold up here because I, I, I got a Draven thought. I just want to throw it on you guys. Just one second, because <laughs> like it's really, I, I'm, I'm thinking here. Do you think that she's doing this because it's not me going at her? It's actually her grifting me. Because she knows she talks about me. She'll get a little bit more people in her chat. I mean, I'm just saying. I don't know. Just spitball. You know, just thinking. <laughs> I could be nuts. I'm probably nuts, folks. You know, I, I, I probably should go to the doctor. <laughs> Say I lost it. But, you know, I just... I, I, you know, the positivity and the good vibes just really made me feel like... Just good about doing this in a way where, you know, it's just chill. <laughs> Well, uh, I got 182 of you here. Make sure you like. Thank you all for being here. I really, really appreciate it. And we'll go back to Shani. <laughs> Sorry, folks. I guess I can give you a chance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you give me a chance. Half the people I know are in your chat, <laughs> but you're giving me you a chance. You left a message on my Instagram? Okay, I'll look at it. How did you get fibro? I'm curious. I got it as a long-term gift after I got Ross River Fever. Um, They think I got my fibro. They're not sure because fibromyalgia is kind of a mystery, but they're, they're assuming I got my fibromyalgia because of all the trauma I've took. Um, so they yeah. figure it's that. That's why I think lava. That is just, it's trauma based fibromyalgia. Because a lot of people with borderline personality disorder have fibromyalgia too. So they find a connection between the two. You got lines from a tick off our dog lady when I was a kid. Oh, that's awful. Trauma can cause, wait, trauma can cause that? Great. Yeah, it can. Let me, let me show you. Um, I'll give you a link to fibromyalgia. What? Kylie was back? What? I blocked her. Brett, block her. Uh, you ever see her?
It, it's actually it's really really here. Uh, let me just copy this and put this in the message. It says fibromyalgia is often triggered by an event that causes physical stress or emotional psychological stress. Possible triggers include a serious injury such as after a car accident. So. Hmm. Here, that that's what it says there. But you can you can Google the trauma thing when it comes to fibro. But yeah, uh, I just want everyone clear to know, like my uh, my mods have a responsibility, you know, and they know that what they gotta do, and it's you know they but they know the responsibility because of they're, they're mods. <laughs> So with that being said, you know, uh, if people don't respect people in the chat and if they don't respect the mods, especially because you know, they have a tough work to do, tough job to do, um, so to speak, or, you know, that's a better way to say it, you know, and you're going to have to go or you're going to get blocked or whatever. Just, you know, so understand that, you know, I love my people. So don't come in here uh, bothering my people because you will get shut down. So I just want to say that. Back to Shani. So they figured it was caused by trauma. Be it, I, I don't know. I got diagnosed with it at the age of 23. So I don't know if it's caused by early childhood trauma. I do remember that I felt pain in my body ever since I was a little girl. So it might be that. Um, but it could also be what happened to me when I was a teenager, when I was gaining ARD. Um, it could also be dealing with the relationships I had. My first marriage was really bad. Ew! Oh, Brett. Ooh. Yeah, they'll test you for lupus and, 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 you know, rheumatoid arthritis and all that wonderful stuff. And then they'll be like, no, you don't have lupus. Because for a while, I thought maybe I, because the doctors were testing me on what I had and what I didn't have. And they thought that I may have had lupus, but no, it turned out to be fibro. What? Ah, uh, yes, I learned to endure pain after my brother twisted my arm so badly the bones warped. Oh, my God, what an asshole. No, I'm not going into the forest and having ticks all stick to me because they smell my blood. Damn, so how many of these sodas does Rev have to get her, like, in a day? <laughs> I mean, you know, he's wasting so much money. If if I was Rev, I'd be buying Shani, you know, those three liters of the uh, Fagu soda, whatever. You know, the cheap stuff. They check you for heavy metals? Yep. Eat garlic. Uh, she's had those warts. Well, like garlic. I know garlic's while. good for inflammation. But does it keep the ticks away? <laughs> <laughs> you like RC the best? <laughs> and Pepsi is all he could get at that place, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Garlic is the spice of life. Yeah. I want to get some food. We're, we will get some food, I promise you, honey. We are going to get food. We're going to get some food. Honey, honey, burn, burn, burn. living in America. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Why is that song stuck in my head? Fix cause signs. Exactly. I don't know why it's stuck in my head. Do I have to watch Rocky? <laughs> You're up to watching Rocky? Fuck off, asshole. No one wants to talk to you. Yeah, EBT isn't available until the 2nd because November ended with 30 days. So if, if the month ends with 30 days, it always comes on the 2nd, I've learned. Wow. Unless this I mean, that sucks. That sucks that she has to live like this, where she's like counting the days until the EBT money's like ready to go, you know? Please, folks, don't be like this. You know? 
Just saying, you know, I hope this Shani effect really affects you in a way where you take a positive thing away from this and just understand, just, just don't be like this. Don't be counting the days until you, you can have, you can send your gimp of a man over to the hobble over to the store and get you a Pepsi and a sandwich. This month, December, it's going to come around the second too, because New Year's, Probably. the banks are closed. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Yes, this is live. We could go to that one place and get sandwiches. That's close See? by here. See? I knew it. <laughs> I knew that she was going to have eat sandwiches. I'm just thinking about dinner. Sorry. Um, you always think about foods. You ever try mixing orange juice and Sprite? No, that sounds delicious, though. No, no, it don't. I mean, so oh, I maybe. Grill and I <laughs> ate alligator. I love alligator. <laughs> what? Ew. Alligator's delicious. Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? Yeah, I thought she was playing. For real? You ate a fucking did alligator? Wait, did any of you guys already tell her about the GGG 24 hour threat? What? Yo, know, I, I bet. I bet she didn't only eat it, but she probably had to wrestle that alligator to the ground, you know? Go up there and. <laughs> <laughs> Grab its tooth out of its mouth, and then she's like, cook it for me. What? I like eating butter pasta out of a mixing bowl like an alligator. I never too. had alligator. I'll I didn't even know. Uh, What's the most exotic meat I've ever had? That makes sense, had? I've had gator. I've had a lot of exotic meats. I've tried. Uh, I've had gator. I've had frog. I've had escargot. I had frog once in Amsterdam. Like 20 years ago. That is as far as I went, as far as exotic foods, you know. Normally it was meat, chicken, stuff like that. But I did have frog, and it was what I thought it would taste like. But you know what? Probably because my head was so filled with, you know, that's frog. <laughs> I, I need to, you know, but now since it, so long has went by, I'm sure I've, I've definitely changed my palate to eat a lot more like salmons and, and uh, um spinach i used to hate spinach but now i now i eat it i mean people change especially with palate i've had eel i've never tried ostrich um i've had elk moose i've had wigo beef i've had the other kobe beef probably the most <laughs> exotic would probably be the wigo or kobe probably kobe beef because that's the most expensive out of all of it i've also had caviar Lobster. Oh, I know. Urchin. That was probably the most exotic I ever had. Is urchin. It was gross. It tasted like cum and had the consistency <laughs> of too. What? You're so gross, Shani. Mm, but buttered pasta does sound really fucking good. She's so nasty. <laughs> she wonders why she was taken off Twi uh, YouTube. Because his bottle of meds ran out of the subscription and we haven't gotten to the doctor yet. That's why. Candles. So you're admitting now that you're taking Rev's medication that he gets from a doctor. Great. I mean, you know, I'm not going to do nothing with that, but I'm just saying what you just said. So if you do watch this, Shaney, which I know you will, I'm not going to do nothing with that information. But maybe you shouldn't say stuff like that on the internet in the future. You know, that could be a thought. I still have another <laughs> month to go. Yeah, I have one more refill left. Taking Rev's meds. <laughs> no, I haven't, Ted. The poor life, folks. I ate someone's scab once? Is that considered <laughs> exotic meat? Okay, Z-Bonkers, you gotta tell me the story. Why did you eat another motherfucker's scab? Motherfucker's <laughs> scab. Yeah, it's gotta be a dare. <laughs> I'm interested in this story. Buffalo is good, really? Okay. I like scabs. And I, well, I used to be such a baby to the hood. What? Oh, I'm hungry. I need to get food. I'm gonna oh, she food. wants foods. Can I turn off slow mode? Okay, one minute. Am I on slow mode? Aha. Turn off slow mode. There we go. 
It has been released. I don't know why it was on. Do you want a sub from that place one? Yeah. What do you think? Oh, I don't know. Or, yeah, or one of the wraps. I love the wraps. Okay. Sorry. How far is it? Okay. It's down here. Not that far? No. Okay. I love you. <laughs> And look, he's going. So when you say this doesn't do anything. Yeah, but... I don't like the scab conversation either. It's kind of weird. Like, you know what I mean, folks? Like, she totally treats him like crap. And like, yeah, I get it. It's Rev, and he did a bad thing. And I can never excuse that. But I can understand what almost what happened. You know, by just, you know, constantly being gaslit by her constantly and then like you know when he's gone like he talks shit about him to the kids to make the kids hate him so when he comes back they're giving him an attitude and everything and again no excuse but i think i could i'm i think i'm trying to figure out figure out the trajectory of what happened and and now he's just sitting here with no kids and her doing this because he thinks that this will win some brownie points with her and you know that's I, I don't know how else to help somebody that can't see it for himself you know this ultimately is something that he's gonna have to deal with or like what g-man said he'll leave her or she she will leave him by by next year as soon as the thing with the money's done as soon as she gets that she's gone you know because why should i live like this in some other dude's place i mean you know that this ain't gonna be forever they're living on borrowed time in somebody else's place that he wants to sell. Did you? I'm, I'm getting food now. Hopefully he gets a sandwich. I hope he does. But who knows? When he's in this mood, he doesn't want to eat anything. Later, isolationist. But your scabs look like they'd be extra zesty. Dude, I am not giving you my scabs to eat, man. That's just <laughs> weird. I remember uh, rattlesnake people eating that in uh, Natural Born Killers. So I know people eat that, but uh, wow. I mean, you know, if if it was like amazingly delicious, I guess I would have to like go try. But then like I've had meat that that you know like beef that was okay, and then. Like something like really good at a high-end restaurant that was like amazing. And then I'm like, is it the beef or is it the way they prepared? So, you know, I mean, I've seen people do amazing things with crap meat. <laughs> <laughs> I hate everyone. I think a lot of people can feel that. Thank you, Brett. I hope he does. I hope he does. Am I getting a sandwich with my EBT? No. Gavin, come here, baby. Oh no, poor come Gavin. Here, baby. Hey, baby boy. The real reason why I wasn't online is because Gavin was on my face lying on me. Come here, baby. Come here, handsome boy. Oh, Gavin was on. Krista, can I come over? I want some brats and. Yeah, that poor cat. You you know, Shani was going over there. And... <laughs> I was like, come on, come on, Gavin. <laughs> How about you, watermelon? <laughs> okay. <laughs> they they want to play by themselves, folks. The fried cabbage. I'm gonna buy. Or they want to shit in the in the tub. I can't I can't wait till I get the food stamps, man. I have plans. <laughs> I have plans. <laughs> I definitely want to get some ricotta cheese and some mushrooms and some uh, Italian sausage and some pasta and make a delicious like ricotta cheese sausage pasta thing. Ugh. Get a cup, you peasant. <laughs> Shani cooking stream? I could do that. Show you how to make a nice ricotta pasta. So good. So good. Ricotta pasta. What's brat bratwurst? 
it's a German sausage, kind of kind of sweet, kind of spicy, made from pork, <laughs> and 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 it's really good with sauerkraut. But she made some cabbage with it, so it's close enough. Yes, cooking stream. I love boiled cabbage. Me too. Oh, I'm Irish. Uh -oh. oh, ooh, ooh! I could make like a ooh, a, a, a boil with cabbage, <laughs> potatoes, ham chunks because that's cheap. Some carrots. She's getting all excited. So, like chunk up the carrots and like boil that in a nice like vegetable or like beef broth or something like that. That sounds delicious. You could have viewers send you recipes to try too. Oh, that sounds awesome. Oh my god. They're still doing that, Ted? Ooh, kielbasa. I just finely sliced a head of cabbage, a yellow onion, and cooked it in butter and salt and pepper, granule garlic, and slap your mama seasoning. Oh, that makes the Irish girl happy hearing that. <laughs> yeah, what are the Irish like? That. Meat, potatoes, carrots, cabbage. G uh, dandruff. Dandruff. And it feels like so good in your stomach. Like, I have, like, this personal belief. Ew, stop putting it in your mouth. What is, oh, oh, it's a hairnet. You can store it, freeze cabbage, Maybe. really? <laughs> Should eat some haggis. I've never tried haggis. I'm afraid to. I don't like organ meat. But I would try it just for the sake of saying that I tried it. But, man, I'm jealous of Foodie Beauty because, like, like, in Kool-Aid. Oh, yeah, hell yeah, bro. When they you give know you, like, it. a plate of meat, they give you meat. They don't give you a couple slices. They, like, give you the whole fucking chicken and more. I'm like... Jealous. Yeah, she should be drinking diet. Bear is surprisingly good. I haven't tried bear. I have had bear grease on me, though, and I love the smell of bear grease. Ew, what? I've never tried bear. I would try you, it, though. You had grease on you? What the? Pork loin was cheap at the store. Had a bear summer sausage. Oh. I've had caribou summer sausage, which is really good. Caribou's good. It's like deer. Oh, there's Rev. Hey, baby. Did you get yourself something? Uh, I'm fine. Oh, ho, ho. I wouldn't have had enough money. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Do you want to share? No, I'm cool. I'm all right. Totally kicking. Oh, chipotle. Okay. You want to share? Do you want chips? You don't want them. Yeah, you can have the barbecue. Yeah, Yo, look, you don't want to you don't share. You know why? You know why, folks? Come on. Why don't White Rev want to share? <laughs> You guys know why he don't want to share. <laughs> like, for real. At least eat something. Yeah. I had a sandwich. I know, I just, I want you to be fed. Yeah, thank you. yeah no, she problem. don't. You don't eat that much when you're in this mood. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Probably did eat one. It's why I keep my cats inside. Oh, I don't let my cats outside. Could you imagine watermelon? She'd probably be sacrificed. I have something. a good night, She's Brett. Beautiful black cat. Yeah. And actually, let's do like a couple more minutes, and then I want to do a part two. I didn't know. You know what? Actually, I'll check if. if oh, she just got offline. So. I was just gonna look to see if she uh what what actually she was talking about. Because this video I gotta I guess and um uh, do a part two of. Have food stamps. <laughs> Let me look. Yeah, I guess I'll finish this video out that she just did just now, and then I'll I'll call it a night. And then um I'll finish the video that I was just doing uh on a part two in you know, a members uh chat. Look, EBT login. But thank you all for being I here. Know Please open. like. We're still Appreciate on a balance it. of 278. Okay. Yay. Well, we're going to see it if it happens on 12. It's like New Year's. But with food. Boo right. Bradley. What was the name of that one? Whatever. I don't need How to see do you the check? check. Party time. To kill a mockingbird. I don't remember that one either. Yeah, I, I read that. I know I've read all these books, but I don't remember any of them. There it is. Because I read them when I was really young. Yeah. 
But it's funny, I do remember parts of The Three Musketeers, and I read it around the same time. By Alexandre Dumas. Oh yeah, same here. Good like 300. I recommend that read, by the way. Yeah. Three Musketeers. No. Huh. I'll just eat Hungry Man's. Ha 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 ha. I did, but I chose to read it again. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> We watched Where the Red Fern Grows in elementary, and I cried and cried. I don't remember. I know we watched it, yeah. but I don't remember it. I was Let's zoning out her up at a that little time. Bit. Huh. I might have to read this. Because I like classics. I figured that this the rest of this video is just her just talking. Old She's lines, now nomadic leap. Chafing at customs change. Usually, after, when, she re when she chills out, she has to, like, you know... She has to be on, you know, good shanty, so she'll get the cops called again. Again from its brutal sleep, wakens the fair and strain. Ookie dookie. Into the primitive, call of the wild. This is going to be interesting. I think I might read it, see how that is. <laughs> Family Circus. I love that comic strip. Mm. I miss comics. <laughs> You probably yeah, miss like newspapers food. don't even really exist anymore. <laughs> sort of, they do. Yeah, sort of. But not really. They'll be extinct not too long. Yeah. Like, it's not like you can go to a convenience store like you used to, and there'll be, like, oh, yeah, papers good night, right Bob. there piled up. Yeah, yeah. That's still like yeah. to an extent. Yeah, I know it's to an extent, but it's nothing the way it used to be. No. no. Like, like even on the roads, you'd have the papers in the, you know, the, those, like, bins. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, you have to pay, like, a dollar or something to get them out. Marmaduke. Big giant red dog. Buy comic books. Yeah, but that's different from the comics that were in newspapers. That's Clifford. Then who's Marmaduke? He's a great Dane. Oh! <laughs> He's a huge idiot. <laughs> Marmaduke's a great Dane. That's just proof I'm fucking old. Yes, you are. That's just proof I'm fucking old. Fuck me. No. No. Ew. Shannon, you're old. Yes, I am. You're fucking old. And you can't remember shit. <laughs> I know. Alex Burger. You know what? I had had deer. That's right. Tell I'm Red sorry. To do a Friday I had deer. Trivia. Not elk. Yeah, just deer. Friday night movie trivia? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. That's a good idea. She had Into the Wild in her car. Only I would consider doing that if I can if I can do the character of Joe Bob Briggs the whole time. You want to do Joe Bob Briggs? Yeah. That'd be awesome. Can you do him? Yeah, I'll pause that so I can hear him. Okay. I love him. Love Hearing him. Rev is interesting. <laughs> Read City of Light. It's a murder mystery set in Buffalo when electricity was first introduced. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That sounds interesting. Thank you for the book ideas. Mm -hmm. I do enjoy Oh, wow, books. I know there were that many species. <laughs> and it's been a while since I've actually gotten to, like, a book. Yeah, you can you can get a free version on it on Google, Into the Wild, by Jack London. All right, well, she seems like she's not doing that much here. Thank you, Jason. Outline. Right, you write it. Beginning, middle, end. And, but on one page. I know, and then expand it. I know how that works. I've written. I write. Wow. I, I have written plenty of reports, <laughs> Jason. It's not just no, no. It's not like writing a report at all. <laughs> but the like, outline still works. They're constantly well, yeah. fighting. Nonfiction is easy to write. Nonfiction. Yo, it's her. She's you know you know what I mean. She's the constant gaslighter. Rev, Rev's a pain, but he's he's a pushover. You know, he's such a pushover. Easy. A vampire romance novel. Jesus. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh. <laughs> exactly always been. Shit. Nah. I have no... I have, like, permanent writer's block. What? Why? Yeah, right? That sounds like bullcrap. He's got writer's block someday and it's just there forever now? Okay. I think I wrote too many scientific reports in college. Oh. Like, if I wrote anything... Even you don't report, believe that shit. I know shit. how to do that shit. You oh. know, when I was reporting 
through my career as a home health care worker. You always have to write a report on that shit. But it's nothing like writing prose. I know it's nothing like writing prose. Home health care like worker. I, said, I have to, like, know. These lies. What I'm writing about in order to write. Okay. Fair enough. A theme. Go uh, write me a theme. What do you want for Christmas? Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Red Rider BB gun. Yeah, Jason has a story in his head to write. Actually, no worries. I'm just a book nerd. It's three weeks of career, right? I mean, they basically sure to to Shanny came out after I thought of it, which is Elysium. Yeah, that's it. Is pretty much Elysium, but it would be deep. It would. It would go deeper than Elysium did, but I've never even seen Elysium, so I should really see that before I say that. That's supposed to be pretty good. Like, I would write a poetry book, but everyone would make fun of me for it. Why? Because it would be stupid. <laughs> I don't know. See, here's the thing. I don't even know what I would write in poetry. My brain is, like, flabbergasted. It's gone. Okay, it's dead. Then forget it. I wish I could high right now. But I don't know if my brain will let me. Well, what I would say to you is if you really want to challenge yourself with that, you, you do your best to write a story in 10 pages and see if you can do 10 pages. Dude. Okay. She can't even do 10 pages. I don't even know where to start. Yeah. Right. Even... I'm not a writer, though. Fine, then forget it. Yo, she, no. You should have said, I didn't graduate high school, though. See, that would be at least, the writer would be like, oh, oh, okay, you even graduate high school. You don't know how to write anything. Okay. I'm a professional rambler. Like talk into a microphone See, into your computer what with that. like what subject what should i do how do i i mean they have it so she could talk right into the laptop that she has and it can come up with it you know google docs or whatever you call it or she could watch a video you know instead of watching Sean chantelle all day pretend that she was her <laughs> no i feel bad about putting that stuff out what <laughs> you feel bad about putting what stuff out I express my art in different fiction ways, in other ways. Or though. fiction. Okay, then forget about it. Well, you're the one that's talking about wine, so Stephen. They said if I could write a book. I don't know if I could. Oh, damn. Oh, okay. <laughs> I would love to see you and Rev collab a story. Well, you did once, and it was the unicorn with the peanut butter. The gun. Yeah. That's right. Oh, yeah, right, Patty? We were on the phone and collabed with that together. <laughs> it was completely stupid. Yeah. But we were laughing our asses off over the phone with that. Well, you know, at the time, yeah. Yeah. You were excited about it. I guess I was. No. Oh. I'm giving up on myself. No. Nah. I just like literally have no ideas of where to start. I don't feel the need to do it either. There you go. And that's needed to be a writer is you need to feel it. You know, you need to be in that like zone. It's a good idea of having something that you think you want to write. Yeah. Got nothing I want to fucking write. Well, there you go. It's probably not for you then. She's just Not a really. miserable person. I mean, you even see, I don't even write in the Bible. That's how much I don't write. Right. Debbie Downer. The most writing I'll do is tweets. Bad tweets. Because, you know, I'm witty. <laughs> write a story based on your experiences. Oh, yeah, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Nah. That's too tra too much trauma. Yeah, it's going to be nasty to that clean up. Mentally. So, it's, it's basically just her. <laughs> just. I would never want to pet something sweaty. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Uh -huh. it doesn't matter if you win or lose, it's how you play the game. Yeah. Maybe, maybe I'll say that for next time because she's just rambling on and it's been like almost three hours. <laughs> Thank you guys all for hanging out with me. I want to say I do appreciate uh, the uh, support, it's been fun. <laughs> Um, uh, this was a fun, really fun night. I really appreciate everybody. I hope you guys hang out next time. Uh, when I have this members chat. I was going to do one. <laughs> uh, I do love Brett. And, uh, too bad I didn't have a membership. But, uh, you know, sometimes those are the breaks. But thank you all for hanging out. Please like on the way out. Sub if you want. Become a member if you want. Or just thanks for just hanging out. I mean, I even appreciate that. But that's it. On that note, please, folks, if you do have a loved one, love them. You know, don't be like Shandy.
Don't abuse your rev. Smack him around until he's, ho, 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 Shanny, ho, ho, ho. It ain't cool, you know? It's not cool. You don't want all the time, you know? You, you, want, you want civility. You know, you want, you want, you want to be chill <laughs> with your, with your spouse. But that's all. Um, have a good night. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.